Okay, hello everybody. I am here. About to wait. Hi Rage, hi Nako, hi Whisker. Three RRs already, huh? Already. I gotta raise the price on that. One billion channel points. one really bad one but one no one said they had to be good I slept for a long time last night. I needed it. Anyway, I'm going to just have you in the background while I die while rigging. Oh, have fun with that. See you in six years. I know how long rigging takes. <laughs> Doggo keeps chewing her nails. I understand why really good riggers can charge so much money because it takes so much damn time. It takes up to five to seven hours for me, but it doesn't mean it's fun. It would be shorter, but I get distracted easy. I too also get distracted easy. As you may notice if you ever watch my stream. I just don't have the attention span for it. Drawing takes a long time too. <laughs> well, I guess I mean I've, it's you practice probably not too bad, but it can take a long time. I prefer, I only draw perfect circles and I only do it in the, uh, the Spongebob method. I 
Hi, honeybee. Welcome. There's already two RRs redeemed yet. I still owe you two. You don't need to stack them. Charging an Ara Ara toll from people who visit the stream now. make you RR till you can do the best RRs. Oh, so you're doing it for my own good type of thing, eh? I don't know. It's like every time I try to do it, it comes out slightly different and not necessarily better, just different. So like I'm inconsistent and so it's hard to practice it. I was thinking of doing commissions, but I don't want to get distracted. Yeah, that's... Uh, yeah. That's understandable. must redeem one you've done your part whisker you people can spend their points on whatever they want to spend their points on who knows maybe saving up would be smart because maybe i have like a really big community redeem or something who knows that's gonna come out of nowhere who knows you never know Don't let them use you, honeybee. You're more than just your channel points. Yeah, that's already, that is a lot to manage, Echo. I already find it hard to manage what I have, and like, I don't even have a TikTok. <laughs> And I don't, all I do is post my VODs to YouTube now. <laughs> oh, head pads, thank you, thank you. And hydrate will do.
Oh yeah, I forgot I was messing with settings too. Also, let me know if there's any differences in the the stream quality or like lag or anything like that. Cause I switched to 1080 instead of 720 to see if I can hand my can like connection and internet can handle it. So we'll see. So far, I'm not having any issues. No drop frames or anything. So. Well, I just realized. I learned to rig in one day and make a couple characters from one day of learning. I see. I so I've been working on trying to learn. Well, not actively working. I was working on trying to learn how to rig through rigging my chibi. Um, but I like would learn something and then like I'd get to like the the eyes or mouth and then make like a mistake or something and not remember where the mistake was and then not like forget everything and have to redo like a bunch of steps and then I get frustrated and then quit. And then I'd redo it and have to relearn everything because I quit for too long and forgot everything. By the way, I meant to say I've been loving the stream titles lately. It's, I'm glad you like them. I it was I, I've always was bad at coming up. I, I never know what to put as a title, so I'm like, you know what? We're gonna inf we're, we're gonna inform people. We're gonna educate. Them snails got nothing on my brother. Dude could probably sleep to death. <laughs> Sometimes I could. There was one one time uh, I slept for, I think the longest I remember actively sleeping for, like straight, was... Over 24 hours, I slept over a day, like through like an entire day without waking up. I think it was because like I pulled like a three day, like I didn't sleep for like two days or three days beforehand. Something like that. I don't know, it was stupid. And then I woke up from that crazy long sleep and still felt like absolute death. The model you used yesterday mate you made by yourself oh oh yeah you said that yeah that's cool yeah good job i liked your model yeah coffee um and my adhd meds are what keep my body from being like a motionless husk Be all nighters, been there, done that, do not recommend. Yeah, I definitely do not recommend. Um, there's like one moment in there of like pure like bliss when you're just so tired that your brain breaks and like everything is like makes perfect sense and is perfectly clear and it lasts for like a couple hours. And then your brain melts again and turns to mush. And the sky becomes like TV static. Fun times. Sleep deprivation. moment I thought I saw the face of gods and then just <laughs> that was just my dogs <laughs> I downloaded an app at 3 the other night and didn't stop playing until I finished it it was about 9 o'clock so I just stayed awake and didn't sleep that night I pull way too many all-nighters like very unhealthy a lot of it I mean very few of them are actually my decision to stay up most of them are, I would much rather be sleeping, but can't. And then if it gets past a certain point, I just can't sleep. 
Like, it's just, it has to be an all-nighter. There's no going back to sleep. Oh, yeah, I was going to add a, uh, before I forget, another timer on Discord, or Twitch, for my YouTube, too. Head pads, thank you. Let's see. You here. I don't choose all nighters, the all nighters choose me too. I look like a starved vampire. Yeah, I've got pretty bad, like, permanent dark circles from all my sleep deprivation throughout my life. Yeah. Yeah. Timers. There it is. Hey, I found it pretty fast this time. Add new timer. I might not actually be able to stream today from becoming Vetus yesterday. <laughs> Your stream last night, Neko, I, I think it like, like did permanently destroyed my eardrums. That was uh, way too, oh God. It was so loud. And I go to dubstep music festivals. Oh yeah, I was doing something. He got distracted. Sit up straight. All right, activate timer. There. That should work. sat like a shrimp all day so it's too late for you you're just permanently shrimping now that's how you get scoliosis i know because i have <laughs> and it's never too late to fix it
Yeah, the mouth seems to suck. The eyes aren't the easiest either. It's just the mouth and eyes really that are the hardest. I haven't really messed with the hair too much, but I mean, I'm bringing a chibi, so it's not too much. I'm already cursed with my metal leg going backwards and uh, I yeah I, I don't know yeah I, I don't know how posture works with metal body parts I'm trying my best not to just do chibi and learn how to draw guys at all. Well, I can't really draw at all. I can barely draw, so you got me beat there. And the uh, Weezu drew my chibi for me and did an absolutely amazing job. Always. All fully ready to rigged and everything, and I, <laughs> I haven't rigged it. And I want to rig it so bad. I'm just so like, I don't know, I just got to do it. That's the problem, Whisker doesn't work, yeah. Well, I guess shrimp life for you it is. <laughs> well. I can rig it, can't draw guys though. <laughs> One day maybe I'll get my, uh, when I... have somehow a big sack of money one day, I'll get myself an uh, improved rigged like live 2d version of combe when i can afford a nice one i'll just draw my own and it will be a stick figure <laughs> Also, I have to be more careful about what music I play on stream now that I'm uploading to YouTube, I guess. It's like I get uh, like all of my videos where it had copyright things on them, besides like three of them, which is fine. I can still post them. It just means they can't be monetized or anything like that. But like I want to, I need to pay attention to what mixes I play on stream that will get me like muted audio and which ones won't. So I'm trying to keep track of that now. Well, I used to have the can't draw guys problem, but somehow I ended up swinging around and not being able to draw girls <laughs> that well anymore. <laughs> Hand over the PSD file so I can... You want to rig my chibi? I mean, I'll probably still use it and try to rig it myself, too. But if you want to if you want to rig it, I, you can... Sure, I can do that. It's all, like... It's got ready to... Like, everything's, like, organized and ready to rig. And it's got proper toggles and... And everything. Oh, great. You pulled out a gun. Look what you've done. Um... 
Um, I'm trying to think where to send you the file. Hang on. There's so many guns. I wish I could put my hands up. I need to get leap motion so I can move my hands. I wonder if leap motion, like, where it like tracks your hands, would work while I'm playing guitar. Like if it would track my hand movements and then if I had like a guitar image or toggle there, it would match up kind of, I wonder. Cause I want to figure out a way to get my hands moving and working too, other than just having the overlay toggle when I play guitar. Even though it doesn't look too bad, but I'm kind of proud of it and made it myself. Uh, is it this one, I think? Yeah, this is it. You can use... Is it Kaleido Face? Kaleido Face? What is that? For hands and full body movement, not the best that it works. Okay, gotcha. So it's like software that can track your hands. I've looked into some of them and some of the free ones, and it's like... Some of them do work, but they, like, lack in other things. Like, some of them have, like, really poor, like, anti-aliasing or, like, face tracking or mouth tracking. So it's, like... I'll probably end up at one point actually buying Elite Motion. I think it's, like, 80 bucks. So it's not horrible. And I have all different kinds of cool ideas of things I could do with it. I mean, I do have a full 3D model. So, like, it's... All my body part, well, my hands and arms and legs and stuff and tail move. Oh yeah, I was going to do this. Will this work if I just do this? There you go. Check the, your Discord DMs, Neko. Like, I have Tifa, which is the free version of Tits, which is a thing that lets people throw stuff at you, and I could set it up, but when I have that set up, like, the actual quality of, like, the anti-aliasing on my model looks really bad. So... Also, at some point, have to get in contact with a. Uh, don't have to, but kind of want to get in contact with a graphic designer too. That's a human and not a robot. Um, to help me with like other stuff for my streams, like stream layout and like UI and my bio pictures and stuff like that. And I have some ideas for eventually in the future for custom backgrounds. I want to do like my own custom animated backgrounds. Oh, and there's something really oh, I can't I can't tell you. Like I'm really bad at not talking about things. Like I'm really bad at keeping surprises, I guess. <laughs> but 
I will say when I finally do release my lore, I have decided I'm going to do it in like chapters. Kind of, I guess chapters, chapters, volume, I don't know. But when it gets to chapter two, after the first one, uh, that, it, I don't know. I have, I have, a, I have big ideas, like a big, it's really cool, big idea, but I can't, I can't figure out how to say anything about it without giving too much away. So I'm going to try to keep my mouth shut as best I can. Thank you for the bits and the arara. I s forgot I still owe you two. Thank you, Whisker. I appreciate it. At first, I was like, "Wait, was that in the song?" Then <laughs> 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 I saw the bit notification. just wanted to catch you off guard you did catch me off guard it can can fuzzled me for a second <laughs> oh thank you for the hydration i gotta do that tried streaming a game I'm streaming at 1080 now I haven't even tried streaming a game at it to see if I can handle it I'm gonna do that let's play a little yeah I don't know multiverse <laughs> I think I also like streaming multiverses instead of just playing it up because it, it's it's a game where like the matches are pretty short so I can choose to jump in jump out like whenever I need to and take breaks whenever I need to which is nice versus like Valorant where I get in a game and I could be in there for like 40 minutes. <laughs> Steam, like I have to every single time I open Steam. And if anyone has multiverses and wants to play, they're happy to do duos with me. I'm happy for you too.
Why does it say multiverses is... Oh, it's updating, that's why. Oh, there might be some stream lag for a Date. Oh my god, what? You just found the perfect sound? Sound you say? Now the waiting game. Hey, there's my YouTube timer. I was wondering when that was going to pop up. Why aren't you actually downloading Multiversus? Download. There we go. I just had to pause it and restart it, apparently. Also, I have a uh, another collab coming up uh, Thursday, the 18th. I think. Let me wait. Let me double check. That's either the 18th or the 11th. I think it's the 18th. But let me let me double check. Uh, the 18th. Yep. At 5 p.m. CST. I've just done something so stupid, but it's going to be worth it. This will pay off. What did you do? I'm, I'm curious. Oh, hey, Multiverses is done. Yeah. Thank you for the 50 bits. I think you can play Nya through uh, channel points, can't you? I don't know. Hi, Jaded Corpse. How are you? It's going good today. Getting things started. Yeah. Just getting been chatting and opening multiverses and play that while we chat. Ow. Don't bonk me. Bonk. X, hi! Welcome, how are you today? I'm doing great.
So far, it seems like switching and streaming on 1080 isn't having too bad of an effect on me or my performance or stream so far. We'll see if that keeps up. Yeah, and I said this before, but I don't know, there's more people in here now. Uh, I switched some settings on my stream. So if things are bad or choppy or weird or anything, please let me know. But other than that, they should be better because it's 1080 now, so... Okay, settings. see wrong one this one um there we go um Wait, how much time is in the you you mean what time is it in the US? Also, uh oh Alex, hey, I don't know how long you're streaming for, but I'm watching my favorite band live stream right now. Oh that's cool. Have fun, yeah. And thank you for the hydrate. I will do that. Right now it is 5 p.m. by me. A little, a little after 5. Which in... 5.03 and CST. Controller, there it is. Oh no! Oh god! Everything's falling. Ah! Stop. There you go. Oh yeah, it's it's late for for you there, huh? Getting a little better with Arya, but still not the best. She's hard to learn. Oh yeah, also I gotta update the uh Hey Rage, thanks for the lurk. Um Stream title. Edit stream info, or at least the game. Do I have VTube Studio? Uh, no, but I can, I'll get it. Cause I'll have to get it at some point. So, but why?
Yes, yes. One more person and I'm gonna one more person what? Join the stream? What are you gonna do? I'm so curious, Whisker. Yeah, what is what is your plan? What's your, your master plan here? I need that to use a character. Okay, well I can I'll 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 get it. Also, everyone's been playing uh, Bugs. I think he got buffed or something, and he's really strong now, because everyone's been playing him, and everyone's been beating me with him. Everyone's ditched that Shaggy, and is playing Bugs Bunny now. Damn it, stop with the punching. Oh no. Why? Hang on, let me. Oh, hang on. I, I gotta I pause and the other me. Why would you do that? Forgot about this. God, I'm playing so bad too. Was that worth? Was that worth the wait? <laughs> And thank you for the thousand bits too, by the way. I appreciate that so much. Thank you very much, Whisker. All for all for Uwu song. I I hope it was worth it. Okay, okay, it was. I'm glad it was worth it. Okay. Come on! I can't hit him. Stop jumping! You wascally wabbit. There we go. I'm still gonna lose this. What? How did that not stun him? I thought I could duck under that. I was very wrong. Yeah, we'll go again. Well, we're gonna try again. I just really hope there's no one under 18 here. I don't think there is right now, <laughs> but who knows? Do have in my bio eighteen plus, mostly because I can't keep myself from swearing. It's impossible. Why are you trying to? Are you trying to hack me, Neko? What what is this? Stop saying you're two. You're not two, Neko. Stop it. Damn it! I, mm, 
I keep hitting like the wrong directional. I want to do the up Y that. That's how all the Arias play and they just keep doing that until you're all the way up out of the top of the ring. And like, it's really hard. I've done it like once or twice. It's really hard. You got to time it just right and hope that they don't move. Welcome back. That was fast. Come on. I just need to... Oh. Stop jumping! Oh, great. Now you drop a safe on me. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. What? How did that? Aw, bull. Oh, okay. Rip. Okay, hang on. I will read what you said just in a second here. Echo, hang on. I come from a chaotic, loud, synth rock stream to chilled out, relaxing, comfy vibes. This is perfect. Yeah. You did miss uh, the Uwu song. That was a little chaotic. I'll toast because I'm a good sport. Okay, now let me let me look what you're what you typed. Oh, okay. It uh, doesn't explain to me what. Oh, never mind. Okay, never mind. You heard that correct, Alex. You you did hear that correctly. Raw indeed. Eggs aren't good. <laughs> you could just couldn't help yourself, could you, honeybee? You see a RAR, you have to XD. You're very welcome, Whisker. I am happy 
to have a ship post channel for you. I'm I'm happy to take suggestions on things for the Discord, things for the stream. If I don't like it, I don't like it, but who knows? Like, I like your PowerPoint presentation stream idea, too, which we can do sometime. Gotta figure out how we go about organizing that. And what I'd even give a presentation on. I could figure it out. Not spamming the shitpost channel will probably take a lot of self-restraint for me. I mean, it is a shitpost channel, so if any channel is, I mean, spam-worthy, it's that one, I guess. As long as you're not spamming with at here's or at everyone. <laughs> Also, Whisker, that uh, other person that messaged you, like DM'd you from the stream too, I banned. Because I think they were just like a graphic design bot, pretty much. Because the only thing they typed in the entire channel was a at everyone self-promo about graphic design. That was it. We should do a stream where we watch a documentary about chairs. That seems fascinating. Chairs chairs are an uh, interesting topic. I like documentaries. We can do YouTube night one of these nights or something. Let the bots come. My community's armed. We're ready. No, Whisker, stop. No. Right, I would sign you right now for the song that has one play and I'm the only person that listened to it and didn't listen to it because I'm a bot. But I will sign you today. We're going to do a LeBron game. pre-game stretch. Where's my... What? Roller? 
Oh no, my controller's dead. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, 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 hang on. Plug it in. Uh, USB port. Oh no. Come on, plug in. I don't think this cord is long enough. Shit. Come on. Where is it? Okay, come on, please work. There we go. Okay, I got it plugged in in time. Oh, that was close. I don't have my perks, though. Yeah, I don't need them to beat Batman. He must have juked me right off the edge. Oh, he's a good Batman. Okay. Come on. Come on, swing, swing. Ah, stop Batmaning me, Batman. Why do I keep doing this? Oh, there we go. Ah. I was hoping that would bounce off the car. I aimed that very wrong. There we go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, this isn't looking good. No! Oh, oh I just did that to myself. Slid under it. Ah. Damn it.
Mm, he's so fast. See ya. Just had to dunk on him, just like that. Rematch? I'm gonna pick my perks. Then you're in trouble. There we go. Come on. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, what? I didn't mean to do that. What? You AFK? Come on, come back. No fun fighting someone that's not there. Come on. Come on. Hello? Jake Pro 550? He was there. What are you doing? You trying to bait me? Stop dodging right at the same time. Give me my ball. Just let me get one swing. Ah. Or that. And I got it and wasted it. I soiled it. Soiled it. Okay, that was pretty good, Batman. I'll give you that. Oh, you weren't there. Okay.
All the monies. teams too. What are my missions? Um, yeah, let's play LeBron again. Twitch crashed on you. That's no good. Pretty close and wins, me and this Jake. The vibes are too much for Twitch to handle. All vibes all the time. Don't skate on me. No. Boop. Ah, this map is not a good LeBron map. He dodged that. That was a good dodge. That was a that was a good play. Oh yeah, that doesn't count as the bottom. That's the top. It has to be touching the ground. Come on. There we go. Every time. I knew someone was going to comment on that because I said the word bottom. I blame Swift for this. You guys didn't do that until Swift Swift started that in this chat. Come on, Jake. Come on. Got him. So close. Uh.
I just let that happen. I don't know why. Good, Jake. This guy's good. Hydrate. That's the last of my hydration right now. I gotta go get. I gotta go get some more after this rematch. Not every time. It's just most of the time I hear top bottom. Life must be so sad if you can say top bottom versatile without going to unholy places. I it was that way here. Actually, I can't even... It, it, I got labeled a bottom literally like my second ever stream on Twitch. So, you know... It's just, I guess, VTuber viewers. Getting mad top or getting mad top? Yeah, true. Which which one? walk into that axe. I'm really bad at timing my attacks, I've found. I always, like, kind of button mash when it comes to my neutrals. And it, I needed to just stop for a sec, pause, and readjust. Oh my god. Yeah, he's just better. I hit defense that that all the time and I n never mean to. It's only for projectiles. I didn't know it did that. Launches you towards his front. Oh, he almost just... Like... Oh, that was almost perfect. Oh, thank you. Oh, I didn't actually get it. Never mind. Yep. Saw that coming. More options. Oh, no. I'm a snuggle monster. <laughs> It doesn't like a good snuggle.
class today, we are studying Big Spoon. Greg, I need to see that arm wrapper. <laughs> Arya is really fun to play, but really hard, at least to me. I'm not very good at, at her kit yet. I'm trying. I'm trying. People that are really good with Arya are really cool to watch, but I am not that person. But every like good Arya I see just stacks damage. I want. I should have changed that. It's not that too good. Eh. So my my favorite is still LeBron. I think. Unless I get good with Arya, then I might change. You never had a hot teacher. I've had a couple. Yeah. Give me my knife back. Come on, get out. Oh, nice of them. I got both. Nice of them. <laughs> I got both of them. It was nice. Ah, stay down. I gotta break the habit of ringing myself up by jumping too much. Come on, hit someone. <laughs> I can't hit anybody. I think my problem with Arya is I don't I'm not careful about enough about what I'm hitting. Like I need to be very more careful with what attacks I'm hitting and hit them at the right time. about time I got rung out nice good work supermans Minecraft can be complicated, or it can be pretty simple. It depends.
I have not. Minecraft is one of those games that, like, it's, I really like Minecraft and I have fun playing Minecraft, but I have to, like, I have to be in the mood to play Minecraft, to play Minecraft. Like, I can't just decide, hey, I'm gonna go play Minecraft. Like, I, I have to feel it. Put block on block so that block look cool. Block, block, pixel blocks. Yep, you need lots of blocks. Can't forget your blocks, though, and also some blocks. I've almost got enough money to unlock someone else, too. I don't know who I'd get next. I guess I gotta unlock Jake, because I like Jake. I also kind of want to learn Harley. I don't have any mages. I should maybe unlock Buzz. Or, the Buzz, not Buzz. Buzz Lightyear, that would be cool. But, not the right IP. Bugs Bunny, or Tom and Jerry. Probably Bugs, I think. I don't know. It is, it is kind of low low effort. It, most days I don't play games. I just go start logic files and get overwhelmed. Yeah, I do the same thing with, with Ableton, especially when I have, like, writer's block. I'll just look at a blank thing and then, like, maybe throw in some, like, drums or, like, a synth and then just do nothing for, like, five hours and... Yeah. What? That rung me out? That was perfect. Man, I wanted to hit Shaggy with that. Ring out, Shaggy. Oh, I must have rung myself out. How? How? Just get out of here. He won't go. There, finally. Look at him just do that kick. Look at him. Look at him. Damn shaggy OP drop kick. Uh oh. Get my knife. I do. Come on. It takes so long to charge that up. I played Bug so I could do a season goal, and he's fun once you get used to the hang of it. 
Yeah. I played him once, I think. I played against a lot of them lately. You're cold, Whisker? Warm up. Get a blanket. My coffee is also cold, too. I should... Oh, no, I finished my coffee for once instead of forgetting about the little bit at the bottom of the cup. Hey. And that reminds me that I need to go get something to drink. Um, I'll be right back. I'm going to just go grab some, some beverage. Um... I shall be right back.
Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that, everybody. So what happens if we feed you after midnight? You don't want to know. Superman. What am I doing? I'll play LeBron. He's almost leveled up. I want to level LeBron up. The bar being finished is bothering me. Almost done with the battle pass. I should have changed that to my heal. Oh, well, it's Superman. He doesn't need. He doesn't need the heal. Does anyone else turn the volume up at the end of the Coke ad so you can hear the whispering? No, <laughs> I don't think I've ever done that. What's the whispering say? Was that? I don't think I've ever hit anyone with that shot. The three pointer. <laughs> She walked over it and didn't launch her up and I didn't even see a dodge. Whatever.
Superman doesn't know what to do with my basketball. Damn it. Tried so hard. They're in a library to kind of magic. Mm -hmm. Shh. It's yet where they're all singing in an orchestra in the bottle. The platform with the conductor raises until the cameras, the cameras pop out. The bottle and the guy takes a sip and whispers the magic from the bottle in his perfume. <laughs> Not that I've seen. No, no, never. You just, it's, it's just guessing. It's just a lucky guess. That's all. Oh, the platform. Ah, he rocketed over the ball. See how it is. Wait for it. Damn it! He dove! This is... Rabbit! And I knew that was it. Alright. Come on. Focus. Wait, what? it wrong. <laughs> Better get this ahead. 
Ain't that a kick in the head? Let's go. Surprisingly, so far my stream's actually been having less problems while streaming at higher settings than it did when I was streaming at lower settings, which is pretty cool. You did music for a coke ad, that's pretty cool. And they told you to fuck off. Well... Rip. <laughs> I don't watch a lot of ads. Ads, I, I just can't. They just they they make me angry sometimes. So I usually just whenever there's an ad, I just don't don't look or pay attention at all. I used to, a long time ago, I used to watch ads and commercials, but now I just can't stand them really. The ADHD brain. Let me consume content. Must consume. Oh, that was close. I almost did it again. I hate the map that has the hole in the middle. Ah. Uh. No sidewalls and a hole in the middle of the map makes for a sad LeBron. And a very persistent Jake. Oh my god, just let me... And the platforms, all all parts of this make it a bad LeBron mop, me, the, not mop, map. See the damn play, everything, everything about it. I know I'm just complaining about everything I can complain about, but I can. That was cool. I love getting alley-oops. I always get them just out of luck and never planned, but they're so cool when I do get them. Like, that was kind of cool. I had to run after the ball, but... Oh, he, what was that? What, Jake? No thanks, no auto party. I'm not gonna get tricked and hit the buy more gold again. Or buy more toast.
Adverts are just kind of, yo, look at this shit whilst we act like we had horse sedative before filming. Also, you may die. If I, <laughs> you, you, no, you talk, do not worry about talking too much. Don't worry. I like, I like having people to talk with and chat with and communicate and chat. Don't worry. You're not, you're not distracting me. I choose to distract myself and stop and look at chat. So don't worry about it. I enjoy having conversations with people in chat, even when I'm in the middle of stuff. And I will try to keep up and respond as best that I can. You know, sometimes I may miss some stuff. I don't do it on purpose. Very rare do I ever ignore a message. Who should I buy? I have enough coal to buy someone now. Bugs, Harley Quinn, or Jake? Which of those three? so far so I bought Batman I got Wonder Woman I bought Arya and I got LeBron yeah, I should probably buy coffee I should buy coffee I agree I can never have too much coffee I'll get bugs here we'll go bugs since I don't have a mage yet Now we'll learn how to play him. What's up, Doc? Oh, I like the skin, too. Albuquerque? Oh, a lot of- look at all the bugs. Oh, boy. I can't- I don't have ally perks unlocked, unlocked yet. Unlurked. Did you say you don't have a maid? No, I, I don't have a maid. There's a lot of bugs. Okay, I know I have the charm. I know that one. I don't know how I do it, though. What the f- What was that? Did you see what happened to my rocket? What the heck? It just teleported. Yeah, that's helicopter. I, what am I? <laughs> okay, so that's the stun, I think, or charm. I don't know what that is. Oh, he, no!
<laughs> she just got in between two rockets. That's uh Why does it do that? What makes it teleport? Is it hitting? Oh, it goes through the... Does it really go through the hole in the bottom? The Or the... the that This? The rocket goes through that? Really? Hang on, I gotta... If you... Is, it does! That's kind of cool. I didn't know it did that. That's really hard to hit that. a lot of rockets Wait, I can throw a pie? How do I do that? How do I do that? Oh, it's just down X. It's very slow. It's a very slow pie. If you're, is your YouTube new? Yes, it's brand new. And I don't know what I'm going to upload as far as actually making videos and editing stuff. So, so far I've just got a playlist going where I re-upload my Twitch VODs to it. Would I play bugs to like level 11 and still had no idea you could do that? Yeah, that was cool. I just found that out by accident. Uh... Hi, Jay. Hey, welcome. I hope you're having a good day so far. Welcome, welcome. What's your opinion on the super straights? I don't know if I know what that is. Should I? Okay, but Bugs is kind of fun. I see why a lot of people play him. You get some good combos with him. That I hey, I landed a charm for once. Oh, and then I get ringed out.
I tried to aim that. I aimed a little too high. I don't know what my voice just did. You're doing good. You're on an island right now in Germany. That's pretty cool. Deutschland. Super straight is people who... The only problem I have with that is disliking trans people. It doesn't matter if people are straight. And only are straight. But it's the, dis it's the disliking trans people that's the issue there. It doesn't matter what you are. Who you're into. You just... you. You, you don't be like that. I don't want to be in a party, actually. I don't, yeah. I don't give a shit who or what you are or what you call yourself or who or what you're into is you just don't be a bigot, you don't be a homophobe, you don't be transphobic. Just, you know, mind your own damn business. I'm guessing super straight is what is that a term they give themselves? Is it like uh, it's just a group of transphobic people? I don't know. Misery loves company. Oh yeah, I don't have a rocket. I was like, why aren't I rocketing? Stop! God, I can send my rocket upwards too. Oh, I'm lagging. That's not good. Oh, I'm lagging a lot. Uh-oh. 
What's what's happening? I don't know. My stream's lagging too. Yikes. Yeah, so the line is I identify as super straight, so you can't be mad at me or else you're the real bigot. Oh, I see how it is. I gotta go pee real. <laughs> Just cause I gotta pee so bad. I don't know where that came from. I'll be right back. Hey, sorry, I'll be right. I have returned. Sorry about that. I just suddenly got hit with such a bad pee urge. <laughs> I normally can at least hold it for a little bit. Thank you for the stretch too. Oh, I'm also not on. Uh, here I am. Ugh. What I've gotten out of this whole conversation and info about super straight, which is the first time I've ever heard that, it just—it it just seems like it's just straight people that have hate transphobia and then add super to it. That, that seems to be about it, right? It's—it's it's just transphobic people that are straight, so like. There's a a gay person that was also transphobic. Would it just is he super gay? <laughs> I, 
I don't know. I for, it was my first time hearing that super straight term, so. I don't know enough about it. Yeah, it's it's just, just transphobic people that are calling themselves super is what it, is what I get out of it. And I think it has very little to do with the fact that they're straight. Yeah, I, I don't I don't get it. It literally just seems I, I, transphobic people don't have to be straight. You can be transphobic and, you know, not be straight. So I think the only difference between super straight and transphobic is that it's just straight transphobic people. opinion is just way too can involved in everyone else's business. They don't even mind their own damn business. Live your life and let others live theirs. Oh, I can go down his rabbit holes too. Okay, that's cool. Oh, yikes. Damn it. Almost got a full charge. There we go. Just get, stay out. There we go. Super straight he was homophobic, transphobic, transphobic, hate, trans, yeah, yeah. I grew up with a very uh, nosy um, 
conservative, judgmental family members that don't know how to mind their own business and are always concerned what everyone's doing and what everyone's wearing and who everyone's interacting with and what everyone does for fun. And it has been exhausting my whole life. Just leave people alone. Why do you care? Especially happy people. Oh, you even launched this- what? The safe even launches in the hole? That's cool. I'm getting some bad lag spikes too. Oh, come on! I liked your joke, Race. I thought it was a good joke. like a it's it's a modern dad joke leg okay that's not good bad leg yep it kicked me out of the game Understand that my family is the same and they never leave me alone yeah families can be like that see nosy ones my dad left the family because i seemed gay i was or just adopted and moved country don't get the joke yeah i i just i can't get my head around parents that kick their own children out because of who they love like i just don't i don't understand i had a i had a friend in high school that got in contact with me a couple years after high school because they're literally they had no place to stay because their dad kicked him out of the house when he came out and i had him stay with me for a couple weeks but like, I, I, I just i can't believe people are like that i mean i can but like it's just i don't get it Um, he answered your grammar question, though? It's, it would be the your identifying, not your identify. You are identify isn't correct grammar. It would, the correct grammar is if you're asking that, yeah, it would be, um, I guess, yeah, you got it. I'd, I'd usually just go for what do you identify as. By the way, Kami, this is why I feel safe in this community. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm glad. I'm glad you feel safe here. I want everyone to. I don't care what you call yourself, what you do in your free time, who you hang out with. Who you're in love with who i don't i don't care i just i'm glad you're here
I mean, and and by saying I don't care, it's not saying like I'm not interested. I mean, you know what I mean. You know what I mean. <laughs> yeah, everyone should be safe here because we're an armed community here. No, do I get it? I, I get what you're trying to ask. Especially English grammar can be very confusing. And I it's my main language and it confuses me. I have finally started again, because I've been slacking crazy this like past month, but I started getting back into studying Japanese again. When I miss it a little bit. Oh, wow. I don't know why people expect... The kids to have kids. What if I give my kids my child? What if I can't give my kid child a good life? What if they can't financially support a kid? What if I'm having a kid would potentially damage their health? Exactly. I I'm the same way. I it I want kids at some point in my life, but I am nowhere near to ready, and I will not bring kids into this world if I know I'm gonna. They're going to suffer because of me. And right now, if I had kids, they would definitely suffer because of me. <laughs> I am—I do not have my shit together. Not even close. I don't like... I, kids make you very uncomfortable. It... My main thing with kids is I, I don't really like being around groups of them just because of the noise levels. I, it's just so, there's so much. You're trying to learn German? I know a very, very, very little amount of German that I took in middle school. I'm actually mostly German. I took an ancestry DNA test once and I'm like, like 80% German or something like that. I've never been to Germany. Almost went to Germany actually in that classes. We, we almost went during like a school trip during Christmas time or something like that, but I couldn't afford it. There's another uh, viewer that's in here all the time. I got a lot of people from Germany that watch me, huh? Uh, Charlie, who's also in here, is German as well. I don't think Charlie's here right now, though, but... I think that's cool. I got people that watch me from all over the world, which is pretty cool. Call me Mr. Worldwide. two more of these and then play something else.
A big part of my life is the study of sex slash sexual health slash sexuality. I love this subject and a lot of my life is learning about the gross shit. I'd be the parent who goes to school and says, what's wrong with my kid describing in detail the functions of the penis? You are a school for education. Which I agree with you there. The parents that... I, obviously, I think there's things... I'm not a parent, so everything I'm saying is just, you know, take with a grain of salt, but... Um, no, I forgot to pick perks, damn it. Parents that are try to shelter their kids from any uncomfortable or adult topics when they're kids, I think is just you know making their children less prepared. It's not it's not preserving their their innocence or their childhood at all. I don't think. I th obviously there's things that should be kept like the kids don't need to deal with or or worry about or stuff like that. But anything that's educational, I think, is different. And yeah, Rach, I agree with you too. The school, um, at least school in the United States, and I mean, I could probably other places too, but I can only speak for the United States, is literally built to, like, basically train workers for the Industrial Revolution. That's why there's, like, a lunch bell. Like, everything, it was based around basically training kids to work in a factory. And this educate, and it hasn't changed since then. <laughs> The, we need ma we need massive education reform. You all, all school does is uh, reward people that are good at remembering things. It doesn't teach people to learn really. I never learned how to learn in school. I learned how to learn on my own after school. I learned so much more when I taught myself in the way that I know how I learn best and how I work best and process information best. I learn and have retained much more knowledge than all my years of schooling being taught around a way that does not fit the type of person I am. There are m multiple types of people in this world and society is built for one of them. Leave There's at least three main types of people that if you know anything about Eastern medicine um, or Ayurveda, Ayur Ayurvedic medicine. They have believe that there's three types of people, Vata, Katva, and Pitta. I'm very Vata, which is dynamic, like the wind. Um, I do, I learn things quick, I forget things quick. I need to be doing multiple things at once because I get bored super easily. I mean, parts of that's ADHD too, but also just the type of person I am. Ayurvedic medicine is fascinating to me. I mean, I learned most of it by watching Healthy Gamer on Twitch, which if you've never watched Healthy Gamer, you should check out his streams. Dr. K is awesome. One of the best things to ever happen to this pla like this platform for for mental health. You will learn a tremendous amount just watching that stream, or watching the YouTube videos about the way you work and the way people work. I haven't passed math in my life ever, and each year I get 
well maybe it'll be different so it won't because the way you're teaching me isn't going to change if you change the way exactly and that's the thing is like you you get taught the same way and it's a way that does not work for you it does not work for your brain and then if you don't do it you're either told or think that you're you're stupid or you're not as good as everyone else because other people are able to to do this this way just fine why can't i because you're not the same type of person everyone is different and everyone learns differently. Um, I, my way, I mean, I kind of already went over that. I'm probably reiterating, uh, reiterating myself, but is I teach myself the best rather than being taught by others, mostly because no one else teaches me in a way that works for me well i've had probably one or two like teachers in my life that were able to adapt to my learning style and those were my favorite classes <laughs> basically classes where i don't have like the, i i hate homework i was always a test taker not a homework doer um i hate the idea of busy work i hate the idea like I was really good at taking tests, but I would not do homework at all. Like, I, I've had classes where I would get, like, almost perfect scores on every test, but almost fail the class just because I didn't do the homework. Which is... <laughs> Mostly because I was just... I got so bored, and I could not focus and do it every day. If you give me, like, a deadline and things that I need... Like, a subject I need to learn... And let me learn that subject. I am going to be much better at learning that subject by the that deadline than I am you teaching me and having checking up on me every single day. I don't do well being micromanaged. I don't do well having people look over my shoulder. Um, I don't have, like... Yeah. It's the same with me for music too, like with guitar and well, I, everything music. Anytime I ever tried to take lessons, it it made me like dislike it, like dislike the instrument, and like lose a lot of. Like I I stopped like believing that I could do it, because every time I tried to take lessons, I just get so like bored or frustrated, and it, it just happened the same way every single time. And it wasn't until I actually just started teaching myself that I made any progress. I want the, the chat, let me scroll up. What the heck? Oh, here we go. Oh, honey, you watch Healthy Gamer 2? That's awesome. Yeah. Sorry, I'm just scrolling through some of the messages I might have missed. Um. Parents, learn from my mistakes, but you only learn from making mistakes, so I'm not learning if you don't let me Exactly. That I say I say that exact same thing to my to my dad all the time. When you, yeah, I just passed my English exams, and I see now you learned the most of it when because you played games or watched TV in English. I've heard that that is a very good way to learn. Um, I actually have a friend, I speak actually German too. He he plays all of his his games in German to help get him get used to the language, what because he's learning it. So he'll always switch all the games he's playing language settings to German. And then here I am. I'll, I'll switch games voices to just to Japanese because they sound better. Has nothing to.
Your tutor spent the year laughing about having dyslexia. Oof. Um, I have a, one of my best friends, IRL, um, has very bad dyslexia, but didn't get diagnosed with it and had no idea. Like, he, he knew barely what dyslexia even was and absolutely had no idea that he had dyslexia until he was grad he was done with high school. So he said that, like, his entire time in school, he just thought he was an idiot. He thought he was dumb and stupid. He had no idea that he had a disability, a learning disability. I can't imagine. That would suck. Just thinking that you're just dumb. When it's not your fault. At all. I think that controver answer to that controversial question, I would just say flamboyant. I don't think saying someone is flamboyant or has a flamboyant accent is necessarily too controversial or offensive, and it doesn't mean that someone's gay either. Uh, I just I, I think just flamboyant is the the right term for that. Right? Or am I wrong? Anyone can be flamboyant. You don't have to be gay to be flamboyant. But I feel like it's what the what the actual what most people would associate is a I guess gay accent. I don't know. Next year I have seven hours of electricity class, two days of the week, and work three days as an electronics engineer. Can't wait to burn down my brain cells. Oof, rough. You'd assume someone is gay, well, if they have a feminine personality. I know tons of straight people that are very feminine. Feminine. You can definitely be straight and be very feminine. I just try it, it. My best advice to like anyone for pretty much anything in life, and something that I try to do the best that I can, is try not to assume anything. I just I go through life and try to assume as little things as possible, especially about other people. Because most people have no idea. Especially me. <laughs> and I know assumptions are unavoidable, but that's why I say try to make as little assumptions as you can. I'm not saying there aren't, but the part of England I live in, if you're feminine and not a woman, you're dead. Unfortunately, I mean, if you look, things have been started to change, but at one point in time, pretty much anywhere in the world, that would be the case. Or the likelihood of it happening is really high, which sucks. Humanity can really suck. something else.
I find people are scared of me because I'm so against the social norm that they will actively avoid me at all costs. Oh, I tend to just avoid pe <laughs> people in general. <laughs> I'm an introvert pretty heavily. I, lo I just want to be left alone. Not that I don't like talking to people, but I want to talk to people on my terms when I feel like talking to people and when I feel like interacting with people and for as long as I feel like interacting with people. I need my recharge time. And sometimes that recharge time is months. <laughs> my, uh, my therapist calls it avoidant, um, what is it? Avoidant personality disorder. <laughs> I've gotten a lot better. I used to just always avoid stuff instead of dealing with it, especially when it involved people. Just ignore it and eventually it will go away. Which honestly isn't completely wrong with with some things in my life, which is I think why it made it so hard to change that habit. Because it works a lot of the time. <laughs> but in the long run, it's not good for you. That was close. This is not going so hot. Oh my god. Oh, that was a nice, that was nice. Me dive. Come on. Get out, Batman. Not me, not me. Okay. All right, Jay, thanks for stopping by and chat, and it's been a good talk. I hope you have a good night. See you. Damn it. Almost hit Batman with that rocket through the ground. No, oh, damn. Oh, yep. There it goes. Uh oh. Having stream connection problems, guys. I'm in the red. I'm in the red. Come back to me. There we go. One day I want to look in the mirror and like the sight. I just wanted to let you guys know my hopes for my future because I've heard it's important to share that shit. It is important to share that shit. And I hope that you 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 do too. Love yourself. Be your own best friend. It makes things a lot easier. When you're not constantly fighting with yourself and instead of working with yourself, even if it's just compromise. Alright, I think I'm done with multiverses for now.
Okay. I would do just chatting more too instead of just playing games and stuff, but it's like hard for me to come up with stuff to talk about. <laughs> when I'm playing games, sometimes it'll just randomly come out and it's easier to talk, I guess. I think it's because I have to be like actively doing something. You know, it's an ADHD thing. That's actually a trait. Um, usually people with ADHD, if you are actively doing things with your hands, you can think clearer. It's, it's easier to think and it's... It, that is especially true for me. The more I, I always have to be doing something with my hands. And when I am, I'm much better at working through my thoughts. Even though it's not even, I'm not, not, not even totally an ADHD thing. That's actually why shower thoughts are kind of a thing. Because for most people, you, when you're actively, like you, you're in a shower, so you you can't go anywhere. You can't do anything else but shower. So your mind's clear of that, and you're actively washing yourself with your hands, so you're doing stuff with your hands, so all you can do is think. And that's why you get uh, profound thoughts in the shower. At least some people, not everybody. Thoughts on the black alien... Pr I... Wait, what? Thoughts on the what? Oh, is this... Hang on. It's just someone that did a lot of body mods. Hey, like I said... If it makes them happy... That's a lot of body mods. To do music or something musical, it's a change from games. That's the thing, I like I do play guitar on the stream sometimes and I'll play piano and stuff like that, but I also can't do the same thing for a long time. And when it comes to music production, I really can't do that unless I like am feeling music producing. Otherwise I'll just sit there on a blank page and just like play with a synth or something and just not do anything and make loud noises. plans to remove his legs too i feel like that would just make why why would you do that though like that i feel like that would just make things so much more difficult but i mean hey it, it, it's his life Fetching. Because he wants bionic limbs. Oh, okay, that makes more sense. He's not just going to leave them off. 
mean, bionic limbs is kind of cool. Not gonna lie. You can see a lot that could go wrong with it, but kind of cool. My thoughts are modify all you want until it has a negative effect on your health or day-to-day -day life. So, from a... Like, that's a good, like, that's good advice. And obviously, that's the smart route. But, like, I'm not gonna, like... Yeah, like, w the negative... That's true. That's what I'm saying. Like, this is, that's why I always say... Like, usually I'll say I think that everyone is, uh, should be free to live and do whatever they want as long as it's not directly hurting anyone else. I used to add, a while ago, add as long as it's not hurting themselves or anyone else, but I kind of also disagree with that. I think that people should be allowed to, to an extent, when it's not intently directly and because a lot of it can be subjective. What, like, you could say that and then, well... I mean, your soda's unhealthy for you, so I'm going to judge you because you drink soda. <laughs> like. The way I see it, when someone does something that I, my first intention, or like, I, it would be easy to judge, I guess. I try to, instead of, you know, saying anything about it, I will say, like, if it's a uh, unhealthy thing, I will share why I think it is unhealthy or that it, I think that it is unhealthy or something, and then that would be the end of it. And then let them do what they want and be happy and not think about it and not worry about it. That kind of came out as like a bundle of like, like a word jumble that probably made little sense. But if you guys could see like the way that my thoughts work inside my brain, it like it's <laughs> it is chaos in my head. It takes so much brain power just to get them out in a somewhat uh, understandable way. Remove your limbs, that's mutilation in my opinion. Um, I mean, it is, I just have a definition it is mutilation, I think, but... Fingers, I mean, if you can live, but he does weightlifting? Wait, wait, weightlifting with three fingers? I guess it depends on what type of exercise. I don't know. My issue with it is that no trained surgeon would perform, could he perform these operations. So if anything goes wrong, then he'd have no help. A hospital can refuse to help if he his operation goes wrong. Personally, I'd like to have implants on my face and arms, eyes tattooed, and tongue split, but if I have any doubts about my long-term safety or wellness, then I'm not doing anything. And that's fair and safe for you to, like, like you to do, but, um, like, I, I'm, I'm sure that he probably is well aware of a lot of the risks and dangers and concerns with what he's been doing to himself, and I think he accepts them. And I think if he accepts them, then other people should too, at least, you know, not dwell on it. But yeah, for like, if you're talking about just what you would do yourself in general, that's a different thing. I mean, that's, yeah. Me, I would not go that far. <laughs> I don't even have piercings. I have thought many times in my life about getting gauges, uh, but I've never done it. I have a tattoos. That's about it.
I want to get a lot more tattoos, but tattoos are very expensive. Personally, I'd like to have implants on my face and arms, eyes tattooed, and tongue split, but if I... Oh, wait, I read that already. I don't think I responded to it, though. Um, oh, no, I did. I don't know what's going on with my brain right now. This is what happens when I'm not actively doing something. He does, like, some of the pictures, he looks, he looks fucking awesome. And it's also a different story if it's, like, say he was also, did that, but also recommended other people do the same thing. And, uh, like, tried to get other people to do his unhealthy lifestyle choices. That's when it gets different. That's when it's hurting other people. When people are taking their poor lifestyle decisions and poor health choices and trying to push them onto other people. That's when I have an issue with it. Like, I don't, I don't care if you do drugs. I don't care if you smoke. I don't care if you drink. I don't care what you do. But if you are, you know, at the same time saying, hey, kids, do a bunch of cocaine, then that's a different story. Also, on my leg is the is the stream lagging real bad? Cause I've been it's been going in and out on my end. So I've been looking over this way at the other monitor. I've dropped 13,000 frames in the past, like, 14,000 frames now, and not that long of a time span. Yeah, things are not looking good right now, stream connection-wise. Come on. Why does it do, why does this do this to me? His life looks happy healthy and he seems happy and he looks cool and everything he's done seems healed well and looked after but for me why stream Why you be like this? Like, I, the thing is, that I don't even know what to do about my internet. I can't get a different internet provider because there's literally the, in my area, Spectrum is the only one that covers me. And I already have like their best internet. And I just got a new router. And a new modem actually recently. And no matter what I do, I can't make it stable. It just feels like it could go all very bad quickly. It does. I I do think that there's an extreme, a substantial amount of risks with the life choices that he has made. I will agree with you there. I had a uh, 
I dated a girl once that I got into a, an argument with. It started as a discussion, but um, because I'm kind of an adrenaline junkie, I, I like doing like I, I've skied since I was four. I've gone big mountain skiing. I used to compete uh, in like freestyle skiing competitions. I'll, I'll wakeboard. I've been in like car races and had a motorcycle and. Um, I've gone scuba diving, like, I like adrenaline, and she didn't want me to do any of the things that I liked because it was too risky of a chance of you possibly dying, and then we got into this huge fight about how risk is completely, it's, it's subjective, it's, and that risk can be accepted and the, the level of risk accepted is different. I don't know. I also have to think that now that I'm thinking about it, my like adrenaline junkiness that stuff doesn't necessarily. I think it mostly also comes from my desire to have new experiences and to try different things and new things and experience new things. Like I'm the type where like I'm, I'll try most things once, just to have the experience. Most things, not everything. <laughs> and I have had a lot of experiences in my life, which I am very happy about. And don't regret any of them. I'd be like that as a girl, to be honest. If I had a boyfriend, I can't have him nearly die because I'm not into dead people. See, and it's not a thing that I don't understand where the concern comes from. And that's that's also why, like, the argument part of it wasn't necessarily, like, a difference in wants. But that she was more of doesn't think that anybody should do you know, non... Basically, that everyone should be risk-aversive. And I disagree. I don't think that avoiding dangerous things is the route, the, the healthy route, necessarily. But no, I can completely understand the standpoint of, you know, not wanting someone that you're with to do something that could kill themselves. I get that. I understand that. Thank you, Rach. I will I will hydrate. I'd never climb a mountain, but I'd hop in a stranger's car, even if I just saw them on the news as a known pedo. <laughs> See, I don't really have a problem with strangers. It's so... Um, for me, I would say that the thing that would keep me from doing that is nothing has, has nothing to do with safety, and more so to do with social anxiety. <laughs> Thank you. 
usually when I don't do things, it's not about, uh, like, you know, fear of physical safety for myself. It's because I'm too socially anxious to have to be in that, like, be in a situation where I may have to talk to someone. Oh, no. Like, someone that I don't, like, feel like talking to, or it's, it's someone new, or... <laughs> Is much scarier to me than climbing a mountain. <laughs> and I've gone big mountain backcountry skiing. I got pictures from the on skis at the the peak of the second highest mountain in Colorado. I also have thalassophobia, but I'm a certified scuba diver. Race, you'd just stab them if they were a pedo? That option, too. But, you know. How do you know, though? And that's a very nice uh, mindset to have. I've been in a lot of very um, controlling relationships. I don't do well with being controlled. I can compromise, but I am a very uh, independent person and I need to be able to do my own, like what I want to do obviously to a limit and there's compromise and there's things like it's different when you're in a relationship with someone but I, yeah no gods no masters that's also why I don't do well with a job but I don't have a problem with work I, I don't I don't have I don't like bosses I guess I don't like managers I don't do well being told what to do. I really don't. Never have. I have a issue with authority, I guess you could say. Makes me rebellious, spiteful, and resentful. The more someone tells me I can't do something, the more likely I am to probably do it. The only time I'll believe... The only time I believe someone telling me that I can't do something is when it's me telling me. And that's something that I shouldn't do, and I need to break that habit, because I lie to myself all the time. I don't, I don't even know. I can do most things I think I can't do, but... Telling me to do something is the fastest way to make me not want to do it. Exactly. Reverse psychology does not work on me. I know when it's reverse psychology race. That's the, it doesn't work that way. If you're telling me not to do something because you actually want me to do it, that's not the same thing. Oh, you have a you have a noise sensitivity. Oh yeah, you talked about that before. But you're still a producer and love concerts. Yeah. Whoa, that panning in the song. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that.
If you're my partner, I need you to have some parental authority role to keep me, to help keep me safe. But if you are anyone else, I will make you regret your promotion. <laughs> You should sing. <sighs> Another one. Everyone wants me to sing, and then I'm very anxious about that. Um. I used to be very codependent. In relationships but I got over that I learned how unhealthy that was for me um. more panning thank you honeybee I appreciate that also you know another thing that makes me less likely to do something Getting asked multiple times when I ask for patience. <clears throat> Raish. I am much more likely to respond to positive reinforcement. I have never in my life responded like negative reinforcement does not work with me it actually it doesn't work very good in general science says positive reinforcement and is much is a much better way to get people to do something or not do something i know you'd all love what if i sang right now i am aware Thank you for the head pat. I appreciate it. See, positive reinforcement. <laughs> it's not just me begging for head pats all the time, okay?
Fun fact, word of the day is legs. That's the word of the day, huh? Not, I am, why? Why did I, uh, <laughs> Good one, Benjo. Simple, we're not labeling you, we're confirming our answer and asking to not make the same mistake in the future. We must we must correct ourselves if we're wrong. Damn you and half actually having a good answer to why. Someone misbehaving in chat. Just having a uh, conversation about labels. Damn, I don't know how. To, mm. I would say the answer to your question, to confirm it. And so you won't make the same mistake in the future is to assume neither. And then you won't make that mistake. like pronouns you can call me my slash baby clever very smooth you are today benjo okay to simplify the question would you describe yourself as the rock or the guy from that website about hamsters Equal parts both. But yet also... Neither. I am me. I describe myself as Kombe. <laughs> Those are your pronouns, eh, Alex? <laughs> Avakambe, that would just make you a poor teacher refusing the answer or the method we must use to arrive at the correct answer or refusing. I think that's true. It makes you look bad and uncaring. All right, chat, raise your hand if you think that I am um, uncaring.
it makes me look We are God. We're all God. Uh, quote from... My favorite songwriter, you become your own god when you save yourself. Do people get on their knees? <laughs> Chad is a, a little down bad today, aren't you? Speaking of which, I think I still technically owe you guys one more ara ara. I don't forget. I don't forget those things. You answer top or bottom the same was I answer what's your gender? I mean, but that's again, that's different for everybody. You don't it, I don't think that it really matters your gender, your sexuality, whatever. If you're a top or bottom, it's more of a personality description <laughs> unless you're literally talking in the literal sense which then again it also doesn't matter are you an angel because you look like you burned through the atmosphere and got all your body scorched oh thanks My fa I am. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not reading those song lyrics out loud. I'm admitting to nothing, Raish. from my second favorite songwriter i just sucked my ex no gag reflex i just had to flex ah beautiful words poetry then may we have an answer um neither and that is an answer to the question I would not describe myself as either.
Not gonna lie, I'm a bit uncomfortable with the energy in the chat right now. Okay, I'm sorry about that, honeybee. I hope you have a good day or good night. Vote for my third favorite songwriter. Sail on in my memory, a wave from the shoreline, a ship so grand you could not believe disembarking on an avalanche from butterfly from butterfly wings. Saw my last chance in a faded dream. When it's gone, wherever you land, sing your song, take this dance, avalanche. I think the other two had more depth and meaning. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Oh my god, I've dropped 50,000 frames, apparently. I think that's a record. Without the stream shutting down. play games if I wanted to right now. I guess I'll just I'll play a little guitar I guess. It's too laggy for games. Where is my PC face, there it is. Thank you. A sec here, let me turn on my thing that I have to replace and resize every time I do it. Welcome back, Whisker. You fell asleep? I can't do that. I can't take naps anymore. If I fall asleep, I just it, it just turns into sleep now. Yeah, remembering songs is a uh, or song lyrics or any lyrics or names or anything is not a skill I have. I can remember songs, just not the lyrics. I have horrible memory.
I feel like I need to draw, but don't have the energy for it. Feel that. Mom has work in four hours. I, uh, forget for is late over there for you, isn't it? Or early at this point now. I actually can't believe I've been streaming for four hours already. Wow. As I've been doing this so much, so much longer, or like been streaming more, like, streams have been feeling shorter and shorter. Like I've been streaming for way longer without even realizing it. Like, it really feels like I've only been streaming for, like, two hours, maybe. I can't believe I've been watching and not gotten bored. <laughs> I can't either, but it makes me happy that you hear you say that. Thank you. I'm somehow not boring. And chat, chat's helpful with that. You guys are all not boring. You're all very interesting. Is a compliment to your stream ability, your stream and ability to interact. Thank you, I appreciate that. I took it as a compliment, anyways. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm doing the entertaining. Nobody makes the best jokes. That's offensive to my uncle. <laughs> <laughs>
Okay, I'll get that down. Back here. I was reading a text. Do you do session work for guitar? I have not. I have not done any session work, no. I don't know. I'm good enough to do session work. Still very much learning. I actually just recently started recording my own guitar for my own songs, or attempting to at least, and I still haven't got it where I want it, but, yeah. You should add vocals to it. Maybe, but not my own, <laughs> Rach. Not my own. I would definitely work with a vocalist, though, at some point. Guitar. Hello. Can you? Did, what? What? I'm confused. I know a cool guitar playing one. Their name is Kobe. Uh, nice. Just a bit shy. Just a little bit shy. Eh? There's a difference between encouragement and peer pressure as well.
right there. I too have an unhealthy coffee addiction. Okay, he has an unhealthy addiction to getting in weird and unconventional relationships. Well, I don't have an addiction to that. Coffee, yes. <laughs> that emote. What is that emote? <laughs> I used to have an addiction to dating people the complete opposite type of me, like personality type, like I, I polar opposite. Mostly because as an introvert, it's hard to find other introverts to date because your their introverts aren't they're they're staying in their house and not interacting with people, <laughs> like me most of the time. Yeah, I was just told I'm not unique by Twitch. Wow, Twitch throwing shade.
So don't know if I'm going to stream too, too much longer here tonight. I have some stuff I got to do tonight. Yep. Before I go to bed, too. Um, I'll probably stream a little bit. Just a little bit longer here. But tomorrow's, what, Friday, right? No, tomorrow's Saturday. I should be streaming tomorrow, I think? Yeah. I'm glad you enjoyed chilling. I, I enjoyed chatting. Glad you didn't get bored and had a good time in here. make a place that I feel safe in. Oh, I'm very happy to hear that. And bonk me. Apparently I'm not safe, though. But that's the goal. I want everyone to feel safe, welcome, and comfortable here. Oh, thank you for the head pat. You're sending mixed signals. <laughs> That's so many head pets. Okay, all the head pets. Okay, the signals are not mixed anymore. Thank you, thank you, thank you. God, what's going on with my model? What is happening? Ah! Okay, there we go. You're about to sing Chasing Cars, and then the chord changed. Is that the chord progression of Chasing Cars? The last one I just did? The little... the... this? That's, uh, um, why am I drawing a blank right now? Star Shopping by Lil Peep. <laughs> like one of the few Lil's I actually, like, rip. Very good guitar riff, though. Even though in the song is very distorted and in the background, but...
Uh, ah, no, stop. Oh god, I sung this at a bar and the drunk started wailing at me. It was so emotional. <laughs> My mom's wedding song, so she practically smashes the car radio when it comes on. It is a good song. It's one of the, the songs that got me into fingerstyle guitar, actually. One of the first ones I learned. Or tried to learn, at least. It is a beautiful song. Fun fact, um, Elvis wrote no songs. He was not a songwriter. He was a performer. And very few people prior to the Beatles both performed and wrote their own music. Fun fact. You probably know that, though. But for other people... I don't know why, but I could sing Sweet Home Alabama to this chord. It does have that folky vibe to it. It's, um, uh, Dirty Paws by, of Monsters and Men. First heard it in The Secret Life of Walter Mitty, which is actually one of my favorite movies. TVH. I can play Hillside Boys and Petrus perfectly on almost any instrument, yeah. <laughs> I don't think I can play anything perfect. I don't think perfect exists. And if it does, it's subjective. Which is why it doesn't exist. Perfect to me meaning not too bad. I know most people don't actually use mean perfect in the literal sense, but in the literal sense, I don't think it exists. That's why I say practice makes progress instead of practice makes perfect. 
I don't think anyone or anything is perfect. Have a good night, by the way. You going to bed? Well, I... Oh, yeah, it is like 2 a.m. for you, huh? You should probably do that. If you are going to bed, I hope you have a good night's sleep. Thank you for hanging out, and thank you for being in the stream. Chatting. I'm probably going to be ending really, really soon here. Let me just play a couple more songs and then probably end it. Practice makes boredom an eventual ending of hobbies. True, unless you find out... I mean, it used to be that way for me until I started practicing multiple things at once. So when that boredom hit, I just stop for a little bit and then come back to it. And I practice in different ways. I won't practice the same way every time. I know my practice way isn't the most efficient way. But I am not an efficient person. I'm a kin I'm a I'm more of a a pers a creature of convenience. The more convenient something is for me, the more likely I am to do it. Which is why like with my another trick I found to help myself with doing things is leaving them out, not putting them away. If I put stuff away, I'm much less likely to take it back out again. So I need stuff out, visible, and easily accessible if I want to actively remember to use them or whatever it is. Want to tell, you're not going to bed, you just want to tell me to enjoy your night. Oh, well that was... Thank you. I hope you're enjoying your night, too. I'm not gout is my new favorite typo. Dude, minus two. Um, I li and everything at my computer is all accessible. Like, I'm in, like, a little spot. And then I've got, like, my computer and, like, a MIDI keyboard and my normal setup and my audio interface and everything in front of me. Uh, three monitors, my studio monitors... The headphones, and then to my left, I have my, like, keyboard, or, like, my full Alessis keyboard. Behind that is where I put my, uh, my guitar, I set over there, and then I've got an electric drum pad in the back corner, um, with my drumsticks out and next to it right away. I have my DJ mixer out on a table behind me that's ready to go. Like, I have everything around me accessible and ready to go, so that it takes as little work as possible to get it set up. Because that way I know I'm more likely to use it. For me, it truly is out of sight, out of mind. <laughs> Which is not conducive to practice. This reminds me of something. I just randomly started strumming that, but... Uh, the, the Portal song, I think. Still Alive, that's what it reminds me of a little bit. Not exact, but... Hallelujah. I mean, Hallelujah is, um, I know part of Hallelujah. It's actually one that I'm working on learning. It is, it is similar. Like the ARP there was similar to Hallelujah a little bit. You're right though, now that I'm thinking about it in my head. I know the bit that goes, Holly. <laughs> the bit everyone knows. It goes like this, the hallelujah.
I don't know what the tab is for it, but I think it's something like... I actually don't know that one from memory. I have to look at the tab. Probably do like two more songs and then I think I might call it. I'm playing Shrek tunes. Singing it as an 11 year old and singing it as an 18 year old is very different meaning. That is very true for many things, including shows that you watched as a kid. Watching it as a kid is very different than watching it as an adult. You notice different things and meanings and yeah. Mm -hmm. I messed that up, but we're going to continue and go to the solo anyway. <laughs> and I messed that up anyways. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, we're going to restart that. I want to do that again. Damn it.
Damn it. I got my own head too much. Oh well. The less I think, the better I do. And the better I play. As soon as I start consciously thinking about what I'm doing, I make mistakes. And then overthink the mistakes. Wolf, cat, wat, wat, walt, coat, walt, wat. Uh, yeah, all of the above. And thank you for the head pat too. I needed that during the song. It gave me a good confidence boost. brain's starting to, to shut off too which is a <laughs> so i'm gonna do one more song here and then i think i'm going to call it oh so, make it a good one eh Capo's not on all the way. Let me fix that first. Let me start. There we go. Much better.
we'll do the ending. We'll finish it. We'll, we'll do it later. That's it. That's what I got now for tonight. Loving this. I'm glad that you enjoyed it. But I do think that's where I'm going to call it here for tonight. So thank you, everyone. Thank you, everyone that's been here. Alex, thank you for hanging out and chatting. I appreciate it. Thank you, everybody. Um, I will see you again probably tomorrow. If not tomorrow, for sure on Sunday. So I hope you all have a good night. And as the song said, I hope I see you again. Ha ha, I'm funny. Ha ha, ha. All right. Bye, guys. Thank you again. <laughs>